Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today I have prepared interesting problem for you. It seems like it is very easy but not many of you probably would solve this problem correctly. So that makes this problem interesting. So here is a problem uh, ratio of the bases A and G to T and C on the same strand of the duplex DNA is 0 0.3. What is the ratio on complementary strand? And right away I can say that uh, it's not going to be 0 0.3. Some of you may think that uh, ratio on the other strand of the DNA would be the same because we have a complementary basis, which is, uh, as you know, uh, adenine base pairs with thymine and guanine base pairs with cytosine. So the ratio have to be the same. It's not true. Some of you may think that the ratio have to be 0 0.7 this is also not true. So take a look. Mm, I'm going to show you mathematical method how to solve this problem and then logical method. So I advise you to watch uh, this video to the end. So it would be clear for you how to solve such type of problems. And uh, again, we have a ratio according to our problem uh, of the basis A and G to basis T and C on the same strand of the double stranded DNA and the ratio is 0 0.3. And many of you can agree with me that uh, it is the same as 0 0.3 divided by 1. So uh, anything divided by 1 would be the same number. So on the complementary strand of the DNA uh, ratio of A and G to T and C is going to be 1 divided by 0 0.3, which is going to be 3.3. .3. This is going to be ratio on the complementary strand of the DNA. If you are still confused, here is my explanation. So we have basis A and G. So uh, Let's say we have A, A, and G. And we have 10 bases, which is uh, T and C on the same strand of the DNA. So T, C, T, C, T, C, T, C, and T, C. So let's count 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So we have ratio of A and G as 3 to 10. If we divide 3 by 10, we are going to get 0 0.3. And this is what we have here, 0 0.3. And this is according to our problem. Now let's build a complementary strand of the DNA. And as you see, adenine uh, base pairs with thymine. So we put uh, thymine, thymine here. And guanine base pairs with cytosine. So we put uh, cytosine here. Now uh, we put adenine, guanine, adenine, guanine, adenine, guanine, adenine, guanine, adenine, and guanine on the complementary strand of the DNA because uh, thymine base pairs with uh, adenine and cytosine with guanine. And now what uh, is going to be our ratio? Our ratio of uh, A and G would be 10 to T and C, which is 3 here, so would be 3.3. Uh, Again, this is rounded number, and this is the same number as we got here. But now I think it is clear for you uh, this ratio using this logical method. And this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. And see you in the next video. Goodbye.